I don't know if you guys can see that bit of wind and snow we have this morning. It wasn't quite the case last night. So guys, last night wasn't the best night for us. This whole week has been really tough. If you follow me on Instagram, you probably know that my youngest daughter had a crazy virus. She was so unwell. She had a very high fever over the weekend and then it all turned into some crazy rash and blisters that she's still covered with. She's not contagious and she's super happy right now. However, I seem to have caught this from her. I don't have any rash on me, thankfully, but I did have fever for the last couple of days. Last night we all woke up, all girls woke up around 2 a.m. because it just felt like the house was shaking. Ollie sleeps on the side of the bed that is a bit farther away from the window and that I assume automatically puts him in some different universe where there's no noise and he doesn't get to wake up at night. I looked outside the window at 2 a.m. and I was really surprised to see the huge spruce trees that we have all over the place and I have never seen huge trees like that bending so much from the wind. Um, it's not as windy here in Calgary in general that I've noticed as it was in Southampton in England where we're from. Uh, we used to live on the south coast of England and it was always very windy and I usually notice that it's not as windy here but last night was intense so I woke up about quarter to two because it was so loud and I checked our front door security camera because it was triggered not once but eight times. I will put the videos from there so you can see. It doesn't look as impressive but it was triggered by the wind and the snow blowing into the camera. It was very very loud and there was a lot going on so I haven't slept since 2am. I don't know how I'm gonna function today still recovering from my virus and on such little sleep and with such drastic change in temperature it was up to I don't know plus five eight yesterday it's minus eight today so it's not as drastic as when she knows come in the middle of winter but still super intense the wind is still blowing and the snow is still falling but it's not as bad there's not as much snow I can see outside I'll show you later probably because the snow just blowing horizontally <laughs> it doesn't get to the ground so much I am happy to see that my channel is slowly turning into weather forecast reports from Calgary <laughs> I hope that's not where it's headed and that's what I'm talking about so our neighbors live they bins trash bins outside and it just got blown over again we've seen lots of this kind of situations in England so that's not a big deal but it was very very loud last night all right Tessa and I have to run some errands at Market Mall look at the lady crossing the road <laughs> it's so cold it's minus nine right now awful but look at that and we're going towards my favorite coffee shop i'm gonna get me some coffee from deville and this is where santa is going to be very very soon so looking forward to it we are here actually because we're going to see disney on ice tomorrow and i wanted to make it extra special for this little girl and we had to go and get a disney dress for her and that's done. It's not yet ready, but that's Santa's throne. That's where they will be taking pictures and potentially charging lots of money, but who cares? It's Christmas. Okay, reporting from the scene. It's cold. It feels like a real, real winter is here. I think back in England, I had like one coat, maybe two, that were out almost all the time. I had one winter coat, that this one, that I almost never wore, despite how cute it is. And I had a raincoat that I wore all the time. Summer or winter, it didn't matter. It was raining a lot. So I was wearing that quite a lot. And here in Calgary, I have 
summer clothes, mid-season clothes and winter clothes. And I think it's time to put the mid-season clothes away because I will not be wearing raincoats, I will not be wearing trench coats, I will not be wearing just fall coats. It's this and whatever's bigger and warmer from now on. So we're done, we found the dress and we're leaving Market Mall right now and tomorrow is a super exciting day. I'm taking Tessa and Tessa only to see Disney on ice. I love Disney and I'm so happy to see Tessa being in love with Disney movies. Her favorite princess is... What's your favorite princess? Uh, Belle. Belle. But we didn't get Belle dress for her because it would be too long and it's snowing everywhere <laughs> and we're taking public transport we're going by LRT tomorrow because if it's just me I'd rather not drive because I'm not confident driving around Calgary and especially on snow I'd, I'd rather not so Ollie will drop us off at the station don't forget to follow me on Instagram because I will be posting from there and you'll find out what Princess Tessa will be thank you so much for joining us for this video give it a like don't forget to subscribe if you're new here we talk a lot about calgary but just in a very casual way so if that's something you want to see don't forget to subscribe and we'll see you all again next time Bye.